Hey, how's it going, everyone? We're playing some more Sly 3. All right, everybody, let's go ahead and uh, do Bentley's mission. We're going to start off with Bentley here. Hail, O Guru of the Stone! Murray has purified Ayers Rock, and now I humbly deliver your walking stick and moonstone! The time for escape has come! Ooh, da, da. Thank you, you're too kind. But tell me, how do you plan to escape? Over da, in da. Gadzooks! You can transform yourself! Why, once you change shape, a guard is sure to come inside and investigate! Hey, Rafa Honda! Hi, Baba Honda! Too true! Wait, here comes a guard! Let's grab him! and jump on his head. I am now the rock. Faster, jump on his back. Bop. Let's show these miners who's hmm. boss. All right, let's grab one of these homeboys. And we can actually... Oh, okay, I did not mean to do that. Let's go ahead and transform into something fun. Bop. Where'd I go? You'll never know. And now you're mine. I love uh, missions with the Guru guy because you can. These guys are super fast. They jump a lot, and you can actually do their attacks, which is kind of cool. So if we grab one of the gun people, we actually get to use his his gun, which is super fun. Your talents are impressive, Guru. <laughs> he is my favorite homeless man. I hear you. Those drills are tearing up the landscape. They appear to be fragile at the base. Ram a guard into it, and the whole apparatus should break apart. Oh, yeah. Some things never change. Okay. So we just got to grab a bunch of animals and uh, commit some war crimes and send them straight into drills. Very nice. I'm sure the Guru's uh, non-violence uh, shtick is, really makes sense with this one. Right, where are you guys at? I'm trying to get some... I'm trying to commit violence. I'm here to commit domestic abuse. Alright, here we go. I am going to send you into a drill. Alright, some other kangaroos or other homies. Just chilling about. Someone up there that I missed. Oh, I'm gonna get like an ultra jump on this dude. Bop. Alright, let's keep finding a couple more people. Is there someone up here that I can grab? Nope. There is another kangaroo up here. I could potentially. Oh, yeah, let's grab that dude. He's not doing anything right now with his life. Well, then you are mine. Here we go. I love their little running... Whoops, I did not mean to do that. I love their little running animation. I, it's, I find it hilarious. Yeah, these guys are hoes. Oop, last dude. Perfect. Thank you for being where you're being. Bop. No. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we're going to transform into a rock real quick. I don't know. You're mine. Oh, no. I guess the second he sees me, all of a sudden, I'm not allowed to take over his mind anymore. There we go. Skirt. Where do I need to go? I think we can, uh, we can make that work. Let's go all the way around with him. Smoke bomb. Also, I don't know why that sounds hilarious to me. <laughs> okay. Get out of my way, please. I am having a tantrum. That grinder is tearing up Wave Rock! 
I know, it's awful. However, the link generator is weak, easily destroyed, provided you can jump a few guards over there and ram it. Huh, what don't I? I think we can make that work. Alright, come here, big guy. Oh, this is the dude with the gun. So we can shoot a couple of times. This is so sick. Oh, no. I actually almost fell off there. That was that was almost really bad. You're the master. Oh, yeah. Master. I know who I is. Alright, we'll let that dude turn around really quickly. Skirt. Thank you for your talents. By talents, I mean your skull. Pop. Mm. <laughs> Hot oily tears from my righteous blow. I love Murray. Alright, where's the last dude? Ooh, another gun guy. Wanna well, guess some, huh? I wanna go see if I can like shoot someone. But I also feel like I don't feel like throwing the mission, so maybe we'll just go. I'm sure we'll have another mission with our homeboy here. I feel like we like almost caused a bigger mess because now someone's gonna have to clean that up. The guru has agreed to join our team, provided we can rid his homeland of the dingo miners and deal with the mask of dark earth. A tall order, but we're up for it. First, we'll enlist the aid of some local wildlife to help thin out the miners' ranks. Murray will feed our foes to a local giant crocodile. With some luck, he'll take a liking to the taste of miners and chow down on them left and right. Second, we'll hit these guys where they live, or at least relax. If we can clear them out of this lemonade bar, it'll be a crippling blow to their morale. They'll be begging to go home. And finally, Sly will use some mining equipment to drill for radioactive oil deep beneath the dried lake bed. Trust me, it's the key to getting rid of the Mask of Dark Earth. Let's go ahead and head over to the Thief Net. I want to buy something right here, the Paraglide. So, I'm very, very surprised they're offering it this early in the game. Usually they give it to you like later in the game for like a specific mission where you need to be really high, but they're just outright giving it to us so i'm going to be taking the paraglide and then also the hover pack here this will help a lot with bentley bentley's a little hard to get around currently so let's go ahead and get that hover pack and i think next we're going to go ahead and save up for these rocket boots um let's go ahead and grab sly and we'll get the first mission going here and fun fact this is actually the third time i'm recording this because um my power keeps going out for some reason and it's happening every like 10 to 15 so i've basically had to restart this three times but um i've sat around for like 20 minutes and it hasn't happened since so i'm assuming um i'm good and obviously if you guys see this video then you'll know that it didn't go out because if the power goes out the file gets corrupted so let's go ahead and uh run it for a All third right, time boys, look tough and get angry it's time to intimidate the locals. I'm not sure I can do it. How do you guys get angry? Find the match deep inside yourself. Light it and let the fire burn up your guts and boil your blood. Uh, yeah, I pretty much do the same thing. Look, our goal is to drive away these miners and we'll do whatever it takes. Okay. Let's get the boys out of here. Oh, listen up, dirt bags. Time to clear out. From now on, this bar is Cooper Gang turf. Top took waga. But you ain't got That's gotta be racist. With us. We here are known around these parts for our drinking skills. Your lemonade. This just happens to be a lemonade bar. Sly, lemonade. I'm not sure this is such a good idea. 
I think I'm gonna have sugar hangovers after this. What you had in mind, then the three of us will take on the best three lemonade drinkers you've got. Hey, Dinkum, losers have to clear out. All right, let's go ahead and uh, out drink them on lemonade here. Lemonade. Ready, steady, go. All right, so I've got the controller up on my desk here. We just have to mash buttons. Here we go. And from what I've seen, Sly drinks fast, Murray drinks extremely flat, fast, and then Bentley drinks fairly slow. So we're going to get quite a big head start with Murray here. You can see he literally needs like four gulps, and he's literally done. Now Bentley is going to take a little bit more time here. He's kind of a little slow drinker. He's got a small mouth. Remember to breathe. <laughs> yeah, indeed. Remember to breathe. That's not a bad idea. Breathing is pretty good for your body and all that. All right, come on, Bentley. You got it. That's what she said. Go, go, go! All right. We win. That's cheating. Why the turtles spill more than he drank? Around here, there's only one thing we do with cheaters. Turn on the fence, Bruce. It's time we gave these cheaters a beating. Oh, okay. We fighting. So here's going to be my plan here. I'm just going to run around and drop bombs and collect money. Because these guys are going to drop a lot of money. Nice work. Look, at, look at all that cash. You know what? I don't even care about killing people. I'm just going to drop bombs to my heart's desire and pick up the cash afterwards. How about that? Woo! Look at all that money. Give me, give me. No! Sly, you okay? I wanted to click more money. Sly, go get the money. Dude, these bottles give us a lot, a surprising amount of money, actually. No, oh, Murray, don't break the bottles. I need to get them. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at all that money. Absolutely juicy. And we got a lot of moves to buy, so I'm not even uh, ashamed about it. I'm a little penny pincher right now. I mean, just like, whoop. Ah, there's too many of them. I love this mission, though, so much. This is definitely, like, if not my favorite, one of the, like, top two missions of this whole map. It's just got a little bit of everything, right? It's got a little lemon drinking. It's got some fighting. I love this uh, mission. Right, hopefully Murray and Bentley are all right. I'm just sitting here kind of collecting my coinage. Bonk. <laughs> you good, my lady? It's only got electrocuted. There we go. Alright. Time to switch over to Murray here. Murray's definitely going to be uh, kind of carrying a team as far as uh, fighting is concerned right now. He's about to take out most people here. Ooh, look at all that money. I think I'm, I'm gonna not get there in time. It's a little bit of a shame. Do I got a thunder flop on their heads? I think that's kind of hilarious. Oh, I just took out like two people with that. Oh, yeah. Alright. Kangaroo. I'm gonna slam. I'm gonna absolute body slam you. Sorry about your kid. Your kid's getting body slammed too. You shouldn't have brought your kids to work. What can I say? It's a bad bring a kid to work day. Bop. Nice work, big guy. Look at that, dude. We we managed to collect like I think near near 200 coins just from this uh, fight here. Gimme, gimme. Love me some coins. Oh yeah. Bop. Any more coins? Like, oh, look at these three kangaroos! I thought I could like hit them all at once. That was about to be an absolute juicy hit. Is this guy the last one? Ah, that sucks for him. I think this is the last dude right here. Nice. Yes! The Cooper Gang rules the roost. We're the kings of the hill. The totally maxed out heavyweight champions! Those guys won't be coming back here anytime soon. Um, guys, looks like they saved their big guy for last. 
He's wearing that freaky bad spirit mask. He must be so jacked. Hmm. We should work That's like to actually oddly terrifying that. to be honest. That mask has a powerful force in it. It just feels like that's the type of animal right there that's actually gonna like kill you. Not like a cartoonish, you know, beat you up. But, like, that thing's actually gonna gut you. <laughs> okay. That was. You all right, dude? Got something stuck in his throat. He just had a. He just squeaked on me. Try to hit him with a little bit of fire. Okay, clearly that didn't do anything. Wonderful. All right, so what we're gonna have to do here is have him run into Bentley's bombs or Murray's thingies, and then smack them in the shins basically until the shins give out. Murray, Murray. <laughs> Come on, bro, grab a barrel. What are you doing? Grab a barrel. Smack him. There you go. I wish you would smack him right into the fire and damage him with that. Oh! What in the world? He just spazzed to me. Alright, get blown up. Of course. Man, she hit me right before he spazzed. Ooh, I... Yeah, right there. That is a funny looking move. I'm packing slime! Alright, Murray, go ahead and smack him in that with a barrel. The lemonade barrel. Oh, I don't know why I'm getting close. I can't hit him just yet. Just gonna take him around the fire. Drop that bomb, Bentley! Bob's in position. Of course. Oh, oh! He's swinging at me again. Bop, bop, bop. Paraglide. Paraglide. Alright, grab a barrel, Murray. Bop. Alright, I think we gotta get him three more times, probably. Alright, Murray. Drop your bomb. Thank you. Bruh, of course. Alright, one more hit should do it. Murray, you got a barrel on you, homie? Grab that boy and chuck it. Finally, that guy was... The mask. It's getting away? We might have cleared out this bar, but that mask is sure to keep making trouble for us. We need to destroy it. Yeah. Probably be a good idea. Alright. Very nice. Yeah, again, one of my absolute favorite missions. You get a little bit of everything. You get a boss fight. You get like a all you can eat brawl. You get it's a fun little mini game. Definitely one of the best missions. I I love it. And you make a good bit of coinage from it, considering you... It's one of the times you just absolutely fight, like, 15, 20 enemies, and most of them have money on them, so... Definitely one of my favorite missions. Kind of sad it's over. Alright, let's head over... Do we have another slime mission? We do. We have the claw. Okay, well then, let's just head over and do that one right now, then. Boing. Might as well not switch characters if we're already sly here. Paraglide. You have treasure? No. How come, how come no one has treasure on him nowadays? The claw. Ooh, we can just jump on this thingy right here, huh? Boing. Do you have treasure on you? Nope. You ready to head out for the oil fields? Should be right through this cave. Oh, yeah. Bentley said there'd be heavy machinery and destruction going down. Sounds like your thing. Why, E S, yeah. We're going after some radioactive oil, right? I don't know. I can never pay attention during those slideshows. Don't tell Bentley. Wouldn't dream of it. I like those slideshows. Now, this mission. I remember this one being hard, but fun, too. I think something with the claw, it's, it's going to be like a weird mechanic, but I, I remember this being a cool mission. Stations while Murray gets all six oil wells flowing. Use this Super Claw 10,000 to deal with any miners that might show up. Use the left analog stick to move the claw around. Okay. The X button will pick up and release items. Before you're How do I throw? Why don't you pick up that rock and drop it in the pit? Okay. Zoink. This is easy. You do seem quite adept. 
The other important feature on the 10,000 model is the throwing action. Hey, you. Just pick up an item and press the circle button to throw them. You can <laughs> throw things quite a ways. Go ahead and hit that electric fence with one of those rocks. Okay. Gimme. Ooh, I actually missed it. Gimme, gimme. I think I've got the hang of it. Nice shot. Let's see you do it again. Okay. Face it, Bentley. I'm a natural. Hope you're right, because it looks like the miners are on to us. Defend the power stations by using everything and anything in the oil field. This electric fence should come in especially handy for dispatching guards. Here they come. All right, let's do it. Where are they at, though? And so what are we supposed to be protecting? Uh... Ooh. How about you? Can't you just, like, pick them up? Oh, can you not? No, 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 no. <laughs> Don't do that. Yeah, let's not. Let's not get you guys to do that, huh? You close enough? Zoink. I can see all of them coming, right? Whoops. Skirt. Oh, I dropped them. I don't know why I keep dropping them. Yeah, how about no? Do not do that. What would your mama think? Whoop. Seems like I have a great habit of grabbing them right before they Indiana Jones the crap out of it. Two down, one to go. Skirt. Can I like, do something different with them? Can I like throw them somewhere else? Nice. Ooh, how about you not do that? Yeah, I want to like throw one of these things at them. Ooh, can I just drop it? Oh, that's pretty sick. Hold on, this this thing looks gigantic. What is? How big is this? Oh, that one's a big old bomb. Now, can I drop a rock on him? All, All right, whatever. All right. Yeah, come on, Murray. I'll, Murray, I will try not to throw you. <laughs> Look at him, dude. He's so cute. He's just, he's just chilling. Just having fun. Hmm. All right. Yeah, let's try to use some of these bombs. Have a little bit of fun with it, huh? Bop. Bop. Nope. Oh. I definitely threw that one a little far. We have another one of these bombs. Zoink. Is that all the bombs got we got? One going. I want one of those, another one of those, like, nuclear ones. That thing blew up and it was sick. Do we have another one? I'm like, I don't want to go too far away because then I'll accidentally miss these guys, but... No? What? Bro, no shot I didn't grab that guy. No shot. And right, we gotta. No. Bam, do not do that. Just one more to go. You got it, Murray. You got it. Woo. How about we not do that? He's not getting up. That's bad. It, these guys are just lucky I don't have any more explosives. Oh, for real? I think I'm going way too fast for my own good. If I had a bomb right there, that would be useful because I could clear out a couple of them at once. Alright, on to the next one. Sick. Now... Oh, do I got it? Oh, I did have a big old bomb. Dang it. Okay, we'll just throw it. Alright, come on, Murray. You come with us. You better pick up the pace, Sly. Grab Murray and get going. Those guards will be out and okay, Sly, it's safe to let Whoop. Murray go now. Um, what do now? Let's get that oil burning. Sly, drop a flint rock on the end of that long plank. Murray, you'll then jump on the end and catapult. Is this the flint rock? The oil wells. The sparks on impact should start a fire. I'm assuming that's a flint rock. Maybe not. Let's just get rid of these guys first. Did you guys not do that? 
Flint rock. Flint lock wood. Right there. Really? Murray, can you fight them, homie? Like, homeboy's just standing around. All right. Well, I gotta. I'm just genuinely. I don't really know what the game wants me to do here. I think I keep missing. I think that's my problem with the rocks. Okay, let's try to do it again. This has to be the flint rock, right? There's no other things to pick up. I just... I keep missing this, apparently. I don't I don't particularly understand. Okay, I totally just dropped him. There? There we go. Okay. So it's a little closer than I thought. Alright, let's grab a couple of these guys. I keep making the mistake of accidentally letting them go instead of throwing them. Let's grab another rock while we're here. Come on. This is why I'm terrible at claw machine games. Alright, drop the rock there. Jump on it, Murray. I agree. Whoop. No, no, no. Bro, grab him. Grab him. This game's rigged. There we go. Definitely rigged, just like real life claw machines. Okay. Apparently not even close. Dude, am I just bad at this? I think I'm just bad at this. Good? There we go. Alright, we're about halfway done, but it's kind of bad because I've got less than half health. And I keep dropping them instead of throwing them. Stop. Don't do that. Alright, I need to clutch up here. I'm going to lose if I... Uh, I keep messing around here. It's time to clutch up. And of course, put the rock in the wrong place. And I drop people. Here we go. Alright. Come on now. Oh wait, that one was fine. Come on, man. No shot, that one was a bad drop. That one was a good drop. What? Come on, man. There we go. Stop. I still need two more, so... I'm st still kind of in the danger zone here. There we go. Clutched up on that one. Alright, one more rock. Gib. There we go. Okay. No shot. No, stop. Stop. Oh. Throw that dude. Let's try one more time here. Should be able to get it this time. There we go. Alright, stop hitting this. Now for phase three. With the oil wells alight, the pressure differential should draw the deep uranium enriched flowing oil to the surface. We'll need to be extremely careful in retrieving a small sample. Fly! Fly! <laughs> I'm glowing. Woo. Bro, how was Murray still alive, dude? How was he, like, not accidentally killed as a kid? He's cute, though. Alright. What do we got next? We got a Murray mission. Alright. Whoop. That's where we go next. What do we got on us? Anything cool? Nope. Turn around. Thank you. You got any treasure? Well, since I'm behind you, might as well grab the, the cash you have on you, right? Thank you. Uh, at, at some point, we're going to have to take out that helicopter, right? It would only make sense. Can we make it all the way over here? We can. Very cool. Alright, let's grab our boy Murray for this last mission. Only Murray can complete it. I think we're going to have to feed the croc, right? Here we go. Where's that mission at? Time we subtracted a few miners from the equation. You know I don't understand that math talk. Uh, we need to uh, uh, put the smack down on these uh, uh, bad dudes for justice. Righteous. <laughs> Righteous. I'm the man for the job. The guru will start luring miners to a position near this giant crocodile. 
Your job is to throw the thugs into the mouth of the monster. Teach him to like eating miners, huh? That's a sinister plan, Bentley. I approve. Teach him how to eat miners? With some luck, the oversized reptile will be in I don't think that means what you guys think it means. In our efforts to drive away the miners. He might even take care of our mask of dark earth problems. I've spotted it prowling near the safe house. Roger, it's feeding time. All right, let's do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dude, I love that man. He's my favorite homeless person. All right, let's throw some people into uh, Ms. Voodoo's mouth here. Wink. Here you go. Okay. Here. Ooh, I'm clearly throwing him in the wrong place. Please don't whip me. Don't. Dinner's ready. Let's grab this homeboy skirt. You like that? All right. He's got enough dingoes. So now we just got to give him the. I don't appreciate that. We just got to give him more kangaroo here. I heard kangaroo's not that bad, actually. I've never had it myself. I heard it's not bad. What I could do? Couldn't I potentially just sit here and farm money? Just let stuff keep coming to me and just keep farming? This isn't the worst idea on the planet, actually. As long as I don't get hit too much. It's basically free money, right? Okay, well, see, that's got to not happen. But these guys also give me health, too. So it's fairly sustainable, actually. Uh, let's get everyone in one juicy pile. Bop. Okay. Ooh, look at that. Oh, yeah. All right. I, I think it's probably not that profitable, though. I think stealing might just be better. That wasn't very nice of you. I don't appreciate that. I'm trying to feed the nice crocodile and you're getting in my way. Let's maybe grab this guy. Alright. Let's focus up here. Let's focus up. Where's a kangaroo? Alright, I need you. Bro, really? Did I kill both? Whoops. Let's pick up this homeboy here. Skirt. Alright, I think I need one more kangaroo here. Oh, looks like, uh... Crocodile has your name on it, kangaroo. Whoop, never mind. He just belly flopped on top of me. Right, that dude's gonna die. You're gonna come with me, and mission done. Hey, oh. I've located one and marked him with a waypoint. Remember, you'll need to sneak up on this guy in order to grab him. Alright. Go ahead and do a little mega thunder flop on this homeboy. I feel like there should be like a damage multiplier for high up ground flops. Like if I'm coming at you from like a mile away, that better have like a 10x multiplier on my damage. You're about to get Murray's full gut. You'll need to sneak up on the biter with a flashlight in order to grab him. Okay, well, it looks like doesn't look like he's particularly looking my way, so shouldn't be that hard. All right, you're coming with me. You're gonna get fed to a crocodile inhumanely. Yeah, I feel like we're we're definitely gonna get treason for being a serial or treason. That's um, can you go away? Bro, no shot. Just go away. Don't do that. Like, we're gonna get, like, sentenced to some horrible punishment. We were, like, just murdering people left and right. Alright, you ready? Here you go. Take cover, Murray. Here comes a guard wearing the mask of Dark Earth. Let's see if all of your hard work with this croc pays off. Get the mask. No. Tarnation. 
leash and that mask keeps getting away. Since when do masks get away? Since now, apparently. All right, new slideshow. Hit me with it. You can feel it in the air. The miners are about to pack it in. In fact, they'd probably already be long gone if it weren't for the corrupting influence of the Mask of Dark Earth. It's clear we need to destroy it. Time for Operation Moon Crash. To start things off, we'll need the Guru to take out the gyrocopter. With it gone, we'll have clear skies for Phase 2. Now, according to Aboriginal folklore, the Mask of Dark Earth is the sworn enemy of the Moon Spirit. So, given Murray's moon shape, we'll coat <laughs> him in the glowing oil and have him pose as the spirit. We'll then dangle him from the crane. The Mask is sure to spot his ancient foe and come running. That's when we'll strike. Murray, thunderflop off the crane and obliterate that mask. With the mask destroyed and the miners run off, the guru will be free to join the team for the Cooper Vault job. Easy plan. What could go wrong, right? There's absolutely nothing that can go wrong with that plan. Let's go ahead and grab Sly here for Operation Moon Crash. You know what? We're actually going to go ahead and end the episode off here. We'll start it next time, guys. Thanks for watching.